हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू इंजीनियर्स एकेडमी काइंडली सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल इफ़ यू हैवेंट सब्सक्राइब इट हेट नाउ लेट सॉल्व दिस वन एंड अदर प्रॉब्लम फ्रॉम एबलोस्टेटिक्स एंड इट सेज दैट द लोड एट ए क्रिएट्स अ फोर्स ऑफ सिक्सटी पाउंड इन वायर ए बी एक्सप्रेस दिस फोर्स एज अ कार्टिजन वैक्टर एक्टिंग ऑन ए एंड डायरेक्टेड टूवर्ड बी एज शोन सो वी नीड टू रिप्रेजेंट दिस सिक्सटी पाउंड फोर्स विच इज एक्टिंग फ्राम ए टू बी एज अ कार्टिजन वैक्टर so again as we know that this force f is cartesian vector is equal to its magnitude times the unit vector from a to b and similarly its magnitude is 60 pounds and the unit vector from a to b is the position vector from a to b divided by its magnitude so first we need to find uh, the position vector from a to b so the position vector from a to b is to reach that point b from this point a we need to move uh, 10 feet in the positive z direction right so i will write uh, 10 feet in the positive k direction and once we reach uh, this point then we need to move this much distance if i drop a perpendicular from this point so we need to travel this much distance from here to here and this much distance the radius of this circle is 5 feet so this distance is 5 cos of 30 so this is 5 cos of 30 so in the positive y we need to move 5 uh, cos of 30 so i will write 5 cos of 30 j and then once we reach here we need to move this much distance in the positive x direction and this distance is the sine component of this 5 feet so we we need to write 5 sine of 30 in the positive i so this is the position vector right so let me simplify it 5 sine of 30 is 5 divided by 2 2.5 this is 2.5 let me write it here this is this is 2.5 similarly 5 cos of 30 this is 4.33 and we can find its magnitude so its magnitude is 2.5 square plus 4.33 square plus 10 square and then we need to take the square root So, two point five square plus plus four point three three square plus ten square. So this is eleven point one eight. So this magnitude is eleven point one eight. And if I divide this sixty by eleven point one eight, sixty divided by eleven point one eight. So this gives me 5.37. So we can write this force F. 5.37 into 2.5 i plus 4.33 j plus 10 k. And now if I multiply this, so 5.37 into 2.5. This gives me thirteen point four three i, and then five point three seven into four point three three, so twenty three point two five j. And then we need to multiply it by ten, so this will be fifty three point seven, so fifty three point seven k plus. So this is the Cartesian vector representation of that force F, which is acting from A to B, which has a magnitude of 60 pounds. So this is the solution of uh, this particular problem. Kindly subscribe my channel if you haven't subscribed it yet. Also like this video if you people want me to solve such more problem from engineering statics by Hibbler.